Hey guys, I'm Tom the Tech Chap, and one thing that frustrates me a little bit, grinds my gears, gets my goat, uh, <laughs> is when things go to waste, particularly when you could get something out of it. So when Carphone Warehouse, which is one of the UK's biggest phone retailers, got in touch and asked if I give their phone trade-in service a go, I thought actually that's not a bad idea. Rather than some of my older phones going to waste, sitting in a drawer, losing their value, and well, just gathering dust, why not trade it in and put the money towards a new one? So I've got the Galaxy Note 8 here, which is still a great phone, but the Note 9 is a fair bit better, especially with the faster processor, the upgraded S Pen, and I think most importantly for me, the much bigger battery. And also with Christmas coming up, I figured if I traded the Note 8 in and put it towards the Note 9, I might actually give it to my dad for Christmas. So if you fancy trading in your phone, you can actually do all this online from the comfort of your own home. Just go to carphonewarehouse.com, I've put a link in the description, and type in the make and model of your phone. That's the one. Now you just have to pick the condition. Is it working, damaged, or do you just want to recycle it? So right now they're saying I can get £270 for my Note 8, which is pretty good. So then all you do is just enter your details and your address and they'll send you a prepaid envelope for it. Pop it back in the post and a few days later they'll confirm the condition and the amount. Then it's all done. But before you send it off, just make sure you've backed everything up from the phone, you've taken off all your photos and whatever else you have on your phone. Once you've done that and made sure you've taken everything off, it's always good practice when you're selling a phone to factory reset it first. You can find this in the phone settings. And remember, if you do have the original packaging and the power plug and the headphones, all that good stuff, take it with you anyway. So you can do it online, but sometimes it's nice to do things the old fashioned way. Plus, I've been in all day and it'll be good to get out of the house. Rajan. Hi. How are you doing? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'm Tom. So I have a phone for you. I've got Samsung Galaxy Note 8. Nice. And I'd like to trade it in, hopefully towards the Note 9 if possible. Yeah, of course we could do that for you. Do you know when you've got an old phone just lying around, like, it just gathers dust. So you might as well just trade it in, get right. a bit of money for it, and yeah. So how much can I get for the Note 8? Let's have a look for you. 270 pounds. 270, see I already knew that because I did it online before to check. Excellent. <laughs> So you've done your research. I've done my research. <laughs> so that's the best price I can get. Do you do, can I, you know, well, give actually, a bit of a nudge and get a better price? Yes, yeah, so at the moment, they're running a promotion with the Samsung Note 9. So if you bring in any kind of newer device and trade it in, you can actually get an additional 160 pounds towards the Note 9. 430 pounds. That's not bad. So anyone can just come in and trade in a phone? There's no restrictions or anything like that. Um, and it runs throughout the whole of UK. But it is UK only this yeah. trade in, okay. So for my global audience, they'll be like, that's annoying. Do they have to come to the UK? <laughs> they can do. They get to see the Big Ben, London Eye, all of that, whilst getting and you, brand new phone. And you. Oh, well, you know. <laughs> so this trading process, is it just for recent phones? Because the Note 8 is still a really no, good like, phone. To be honest with you, people come in and trade in iPhone 6s, you know, like a Samsung S6. Okay. So even if it's like four or five years old, believe it or not, people come and actually trade in 3310s. Do I have to use it for like store credit and upgrade or can I just get the cash and run? So with this particular promotion, um, you actually have to get the 160 towards a Note 9. Okay. However, mm -hmm. if you just wanted to generally just come in and trade in a phone, you can actually come in, trade it in, either get the money straight, put straight into your bank account, or you can put it towards accessories, etc, etc. So what we have to do now is actually just run a very quick test just to make sure it's fully working and enabled to trade in at full value. So congratulations, that's all gone through for you. All you pay today is £369. I mean, it's still a lot of money, but the Note 9 is a very expensive Compared phone. to 800 Massive saving. That'll do. So we're all done now. Here's your bag and your brand new phone. Awesome. Thank you so much for your help on no that. No worries. Have a good day. Thank Come you. back anytime. Well, it's a thoroughly miserable day here in London, but I'm happy 
because I've got my shiny new phone. That's dad's Christmas sorted. But yeah, that was such an easy experience. They were so lovely. And if you do want to trade in a phone yourself or find out more, I've put links to everything you need in the description below. And it's true. If you do have old phones or old tech laying about, you may as well trade it in, put it towards something that's going to be actually useful. And if you do have a phone you're thinking about getting rid of, what kind of phone would you want to trade up to? Let me know in the comments below. But I'm off home now to get this all wrapped up for Christmas and also get out of the rain. <laughs> I'll see you guys next time right here on the Tech Chat.